Hey parents and students, thank you guys for joining us uh, on the online uh, virtual meeting. Uh, again, I do apologize about the internet. I already knew that was gonna be an issue. And uh, like I said, we're going to upgrade it as soon as possible. Get a nice, good, fast uh, internet feed in here so the video is smooth and so is the audio. Speaking of video and audio, please, when you are logged in, keep your camera on so I can and my team can engage and see you. We can select the screen and get some feedback on uh, what it is you're doing and keep the microphone off until we need to engage uh, sometime because uh, if everybody's mic is on, it will come blaring through and be an interruption. So my mic will be on so you can hear me and the lesson and our teachers and your mic's off until you need to uh, raise your hand or something like that, which Sean's gonna talk about here in a minute. Uh, make sure you wear your uniforms as you do the class. Uh, it's just like as you're a part of the class, you're just gonna do it from home and uh, online instead of here, uh, at least for the time being, if that's your choice. Again, we're going to be open. This is an option for those who would rather stay home and not travel out and uh, be in class at this time. Uh, let's see, you start set up a uh, notification. There is going to be a member ID that is associated with the class. The class is uh, scheduled every Monday through Friday or the meeting Monday through Friday from 5 to 10 p.m. We ask everybody just to sign in five minutes prior to class and exit the meeting immediately as the class ends. And that will be as the regular, regular scheduled classes that we have. And that is starting with the new schedule that starts this week on March 16th. Yeah. Yes, March 16th, because today's the 15th. So um, that ID link is going to be in your email. It's going to be in the parent student group on Facebook. And you'll enter that in your search, um, member search thing here, which we're gonna talk about here in a moment too, okay? Um, so this way you can star and set up your notification. He's gonna talk about that. So, you got your phone? Okay. It's a Zoom app. All right, so uh, he's going to just show you guys a few things. Uh, like we said, download the Zoom uh, Cloud Meeting app, make an account, look for PKSA underscore SES at Hotmail, and send a contact invite, and I'll add you to the contacts. That This way you can uh, go ahead and star. So uh, go ahead. So... On your Zoom app, you'll have the contacts down here, and you'll want to find PKSA SES. Tap on them, and then in the top right-hand corner of your phone, it's going to be an outline star in gold, but I've already um, tapped it, and it'll fill in with gold, so you'll star him, and in your contacts, it'll be right at the top always. And then you'll want to press these three dots, and here... Um, it'll say notify me when available, which will be when he goes online, it'll notify you and send you a notification when he's on. All right. So again, the class meeting will start every day, roughly around five, five fifteen, five twenty, and will go until about 10 or 15 minutes. Once class ends, depends as soon as I can get over to turn it off. But we ask that you just check in five minutes to your scheduled class time um, and to check out immediately when the class is over. Uh, and then let's go ahead and the meeting ID search. Okay. The meeting ID search. Yep. All right. So when, so back on the Zoom, you want to go to the far left bottom corner and go to the meet and chat icon. And you'll want to press up here where it says join. Tap on that, and it'll, at the top, it'll say meeting ID. You'll tap in the meeting ID, which was sent out. Um, and then when you do, it'll ask for the password, which then you will type in again, which is PKSA, SES, no spaces, and all lowercase letters. And then it'll join you to the meeting. 
Okay, so here is the meeting ID. Let me see if I can get it in here. Okay, so meeting nine two six. So it's karate class nine two six four eight eight one one zero. That is the meeting ID. Again, uh, you can find it in the Facebook group. You can get it in your email, and uh, you'll get notified if you follow the instructions that we just gave you. You'll get notified when that meeting starts. Okay, and then you can just use that notification later when your class time starts. Um, okay, so we went on and we started a Zoom with each other. Okay, so what he's going to do is show you guys how to raise your hand if you need to, and then also we can chat uh, as well. So, all right. So when you have it, this will when you do when you are in the meeting, we'll show the face cams and stuff like that. So you want to tap on the screen where all the options on the bottom will show. You'll tap on the more, which is has the three dots. And if this will come into focus. And then you'll want to go, and it'll say raise hand right here. And when it does, it'll send a notification to him saying that I raised my hand. And if you don't want to, uh, if you don't want to say something and you just want to tap type it out, you'll again go to the more. And you'll go to the chat, which is at the top here. And you can type out your message right here and say, I want to say hi. Now it'll appear on his screen that I said hi. And then I just go here, hit chat, and it'll tell me by name who sent me the message. Okay. Um, All right, so that is uh, how that works. When it comes to being in the class, you can raise your hand, you can send a chat message. Uh, we'll do our best as we uh, are teaching the full class to acknowledge that kind of stuff. Like I said, we're going to get a TV roll card that will move the TV and the camera with us. Only thing is the TV's not wireless, so I'm gonna have to have an extension cord. So I'm probably gonna keep it off to the uh, bathroom side and we can just roll it forward and back uh, maybe into the middle of the floor a little bit and then out back out of the way that kind of stuff so um, thank you guys for everything that is everything that we have to show you regarding that and if you have any other questions please shoot an email uh, or text or something like that and if you are connected you can even message me through the zoom and oh um, if you do or are working on something and would like uh, some uh, a Zoom meeting personally with that, uh, I am up for it, but we'll have to schedule it. And uh, so if you got a question on your form or something like that uh, and I'm available, I'll be happy to take a Zoom call for you and to answer that as well. And if somebody else in the Zoom is connected to you on that, we can help each other out because I know Sean's on there. And so like if you're a black belt or something like that and you want to join the meeting at any time throughout the class, throughout the evening and watch some of the screens and answer questions and get feedback and help out, you as a leadership team slash black belt slash senior student can do that as well. You can help answer these questions and help uh, guide all the, all the students that are at home. So uh, be a virtual online leadership member as well, even if you're, you know, yeah, I mean, that'd be great. Be awesome. Okay. So see you on class, see you in class, see you online and uh, we're out. Peace. <laughs>